guys, welcome back to Big John TV, where we're all about food, family, and fun. After a long hiatus and many requests for its return, we are back with What's Cooking Wednesday. But we're going to do a little bit different. We're going to share 12 days of simple, minimal ingredient Christmas recipes. We're going to call it 12 Days of Treats. Let's get started. All right, let's make some quick and easy pumpkin pie snacks. Only a few ingredients again. We've got our oyster crackers, two sticks of butter, and a cup of brown sugar. We're gonna melt these together in our pot over medium heat. You wanna cook this until the sugar breaks down and it gets all nice and bubbly. You can see how now that the sugar is starting to melt, the butter is able to incorporate a little bit better. If you run your spatula or spoon across the sugar, you can kind of feel it's still grainy. We want to cook out the graininess, melt all that sugar down. We're gonna turn our heat off, add in one teaspoon of pumpkin pie seasoning. You could do apple pie seasoning, you could just do plain brown sugar, I mean, cinnamon, and one teaspoon of vanilla. Give that a stir. We'll remove it from the heat and add in our oyster crackers. Toss them to coat. You want to make sure you get all the individual crackers really nice and coated. From there, we're going to spread that on a baking sheet covered in foil. And spread it out. You want to get this as close to a single layer as you can. Now this is going to go in a 350 degree oven for about 15 minutes. After about 15 minutes we got this. I'm going to let these cool just a minute and then I'm going to show you the next step. All right these have cooled just slightly and we're going to drop them in some sugar. Okay these are still really hot though. The idea is we want to kind of break them up and have individual pieces. So any that seem stuck together, give them a little jostle, take them apart. And keep going. They're okay if I work fast. If I keep my hands on them, they're way too hot. All right, let's give these a try. All right, look at these. These look amazing. Oh, of course I pulled the one that's stuck together. Oh, crispy and sweet 
but not overly sweet. Mm -hmm. You get a lot of savory still from the cracker, a little bit of salty. Nice crispiness on them. Tossing them in the sugar was a little bit of extra work, but I do like how individual these are. They're not just one clump. Oh, that's good. I think next time I might add some more pumpkin spice seasoning to the sugar I toss them in just to intensify that flavor. But otherwise, this is a thumbs up. Perfect.